Today we are going to talk about the infant environment at home. In those early months of an infant's development, those very important neural pathways in the brain are being developed through the child's sensory exploration and movement. When we go to set up the environment, these are our primary considerations. Creating an infant space at home requires you to simply put together a few activities. We have a treasure basket, musical instruments, real objects from the kitchen, rattles and sound shakers, bubble doll and teething rings. On our top shelf we have put some cards that we can use for language development with the child. First we will start with the treasure basket. This is very simple to put together. The important thing is to remember to put together real objects that you would find at home and also ensure that you have a variety of textures and hardnesses for the child to explore. Another favourite activity is a basket of musical instruments. Again, you can look around at home to find what you have. A tambourine, a xylophone, a shaker. When your child shows an interest, let them explore. For all the wonderful things that you can purchase for a child, the greatest joy is often the thing that is found in your kitchen cupboard. Pots and pans, matching lids, spoons. If your child has enjoyed the experience of banging pots and pans, then you know that a basket of rattles and shakers will be a wonderful sensory experience. This is a really fabulous activity for tummy time. Hold the shaker and, play and watch for the child reaching towards you. Let them explore. For younger children who are teething, it's also a good idea to have a variety of teething implements. These also help with their grasp. And remember, sanitize regularly. In your resource pack, you will have your colors, Remembering to start with three. We usually recommend the three primary colours. In addition, you have the picture books that are wonderful for explaining and developing language. Yellow capsicums. A yellow paint splot. And of course, your animal cards. It's not a kitty. It's a cat, a rabbit. Oh, the rabbit is black and white. A rabbit is soft, just like our soft pom-pom. And please don't forget to read to your child. Studies have shown the children who have been read to from before birth perform better academically once they go to school. Always encourage your children through simple things like cloth books, but also 
read to them. Board books, Australian animals, mothers and babies. Kangaroos. Kangaroo and her joey love to jump and play. Oh, do you want to feel? It's rough. Wombat and her baby like to cuddle all day. We love to cuddle too, don't we? Integrated throughout your day.